Hello one and all, my name is Ryan Balaji, EC branch B section. Today I am telling about Gein's theorem in a plane. Statement if u v dou u by dou y comma dou v by dou x are continuous and single values functions is the reason are enclosed by the curves c then integral c d u d x plus v d y equal to double integral r dou v by dou x comma minus dou u by dou y dx dy corollary if dou v by dou x equal to dou u by dou y then the value of the integrals integral c u dx plus v dy is the independent of the path of the integration corollary to if r is a region bounded by a sample curves s then the area of the r is given by half integral c x dy minus y dx by taking one problem Verify Green's theorem in the xy plane for integral c 3x minus 8y square dx plus 4y minus 6y dx where c is the boundary of the region given by x equal to 0, y equal to 0, comma x plus y equal to 1. By solving problem, Green's theorem is integral c u dx plus v dy equal to double integral r dou v by dou x minus dou u by dou y dx dy here uh, comparing u and the problem 3 u equal to 3 x minus 8 y square by differentiating u d dou u by dou y equal to minus 16 y comparing v in given problem v equal to 4 y minus 6 x y by differentiating v dou u by dou x equal to minus 6 y by taking lhs uh, evolution of uh, integral u dx plus uh, v dy in the, in the integral c integral c equal to integral oa plus uh, integral ab plus integral bc we assume that is equal to a first we find out uh, oa in the given figure oa equal to y equal to 0 therefore uh, y value equal to 0 and dy value equal to 0 by taking uh, integral oa 3x uh, dx uh, by differentiating 3x 3x integral 0 to a x dx equal to by differentiating x by integral x 3 dx square minus 2 limits of x 0 to 1 by applying 3 equal to 3 by 2 next along a b x plus y equal to 1 integral a b equal to 3x minus a 2 square dx plus 4y minus 6 x y in the problem x plus y line is this by taking x plus y equal to 1 and y equal to 1 minus x dy equal to minus dx by solving the problem integral a b equal to 3x minus 8y applying those uh, x applying those values uh, and we get uh, integral minus 14x minus plus 29x minus 12 dx uh, integral 0 by taking limits 0 to 1 minus 14x plus 29x minus 12 dx by by solving integral problems integral x square is x cube by 3 plus integral x is x square by 2 integral 12 is x by applying limits we get of minus 14 by 3 plus 29 by 2 minus 12 taking lcm we get 13 minus 13 by 6 After we find out along a BO line x in that BO line in that BO line we have x equal to zero. Integral BO 3x minus 8y square dx plus 4y minus 6xy dx integral zero to BO 4y dx. Here x equal to zero and dx equal to zero by solving integral y. 4y square by 2 in the limits 1 to 0 applying the limits we get to minus 2 in the by taking a equal to integral c equal to integral oa plus integral b a b plus integral b o we solving we get lhs is 5 by 3 after we solving our hs evolution of integral double integral r dou v by dou x minus dou u by dou y dx dy by comparing uh, integral r minus 6xy plus 16y dx dy double integral minus 6y plus 16x plus 10y dx dy by taking 10 outside 
we are taking limit 0 to 1 integral 0 to 1 minus y y dx dy first we solving uh, dx uh, integral x equal to 1 integral x is uh, 1 by applying limits 0 to 1 minus y we get uh, 10 integral 0 to 1 y into 1 minus y dy by solving y integral uh, y minus y square dy by applying limits of y 10 of y square by 2 minus y3 by 3 y cube y cube by 3 by applying limits uh, 10 of 1 by 2 minus 1 by 3 by taking LCM 10 into minus 3 3 minus 2 by 6 uh, by after we get 10 of uh, 10 into 1 by 6 uh, by cancelling uh, 5 we get uh, 5 by 3 therefore LHS equal to RHS since Green's theorem is verified thank you